Hello, online world. Um, hey, this is Ryan Woods attempting a video blog. Video blog essay. I'm not sure what you call these. It's my first time, if you couldn't tell. I'm quite the expert. As you can see, I've done myself up nicely. I showered this morning and did my hair quite a number of hours ago for you. But actually what I did do is I stopped by yogurt time and got some delicious Froyo um, down the street. And yogurt time has been awesome in supporting my family and also providing a great place of community here in downtown Vancouver. So check it out. With that said, let me just say I'm really excited about tomorrow night, which is Tuesday. Um, we are having our second annual fundraiser here in downtown Vancouver. Uh, I feel comfortable talking about it because it's um, it's not just about me anymore, which makes me feel much better. Uh, they've actually turned it into an official 501c3 nonprofit, so that every year, regardless of my health, regardless of whether I live or die, this is gonna this is gonna happen, um, and it's going to go towards uh, caring for um, the downtown neighborhoods. It's gonna go towards furthering uh, just in my uh, in my heart for the downtown life and for people connecting and finding life in and amongst the people in downtown Vancouver. Uh, so it's pretty cool uh, that this is having life of its own. So it's at the historic Kick and Theater here in downtown Vancouver, and you should be there. It's at 7 o'clock Tuesday night. Um, there's going to be awesome music. Uh, I mean, just a great lineup of local bands uh, from both here and in, uh, a couple in Portland. There's going to be some great drinks, great people, and it's just be uh, just a lot of fun. A killer raffle that sadly I'm not allowed to buy tickets for, which is really frustrating. That's my wife in the window you just saw walk by. Um, anyways, but here's the thing. I'm kind of freaking out a little bit, and maybe I shouldn't talk about this. This is me trying to be vulnerable, right, and put myself out there. And this is really what I want to talk about because um, I'm a little bit freaking out. Um, that Okay, so I try to respond to virtually every email or Facebook message that I get. Uh, I try to be... Um, to give a little bit of my time just to, to write people back and give a truly heartfelt response to each person that, that sends me a message. Um, and it's just something that's just important to me, and I can't always do it, but for the most part I do. Um, and again, I try to really give some genuine content, genuine thought um, to what I say. But here's the deal. Even though it's really heartfelt and it's I really do spend time thinking about it, I won't. I don't necessarily remember what I wrote like a month ago or two months ago, and so I'm freaking out that I'm going to meet a bunch of you tomorrow face to face that I've only ever met, like icon to icon, like on Facebook or email, and I'm worried that it will be that awkward. Hey Ryan, you know, uh, remember that one time we talked online, and I'll fake it for a second, but then it'll become clear that I don't remember what I said. And then I kind of look like a jerk, and maybe I am kind of, and it just gets weird. And I want you to know that um, that weirdness is just a part of the mix with all this, so it probably will be weird. But just don't hate me, like, if I make it more weird. Um, so I want you to know I like you, and I hope you like me. But if I don't remember your name, and sometimes I'm really weird with names too, like I'll randomly forget just, like, people whose names I know and it gets awkward and embarrassing, and I think I can blame the cancer. That might not be medically true, but I feel like I could use that as an excuse, and it like it should just like cover like anything. My wife doesn't buy it, but um, but maybe you would for me. Um, if it's not the cancer, it's got to be the drugs or the my rosy chubby cheeks that I've got from the steroids or something. Um, all I ask is. Um, is please be gracious tomorrow night, um, and don't hate me if I can't remember your name, or if I don't remember what I said. Um, um, I love you all, and I thank you for watching this. Again, this is my first time doing this, so uh, help me figure out what a video blog looks like that's beneficial, that's valuable for y'all, and also valuable for me as I'm trying to chronicle um, potentially my last days, um, as also I'm trying to just uh, leave, a, leave a legacy behind me. Um, if these blogs are going to damage that legacy, tell me to stop now, please. Um, either way, uh, thanks so much for watching. Y'all have a good night. And I hope to see you tomorrow night, Tuesday at Kiggins, Tuesday, July 17th um, at 7 o'clock.